Question 6. Here are three bags in a shop. Bag A, bag B, bag C, and they're all different prices. Bag A is £11.50, bag B is £14.65, and bag C is £16.50. First part of this question is how much does bag B cost to the nearest pound? Well, we've got £14.65. Now, the whole pound beneath that would be £14. And the whole pound above that would be £15. And halfway between would be £14.50. Now, see this £14.65 is higher than £14.50, it's higher than halfway, and if it's higher than halfway, we round up. So to the nearest pound, it would be £15. Get a different colour for the second part of the question. It says, Jamie buys bag A and bag C. How much change does he get from £40? Show your work and you may get a mark. First thing we need to do is make sure we get the correct two prices. So bag A, is £11.50 and bag C so we want A and C is £16.50 so we need to add up how much he's spending all together 0 add 0 is 0 5 add 5 is 10 put your 0 and carry your 1 1 plus 6 is 7 plus that 1 is 8 1 plus 1 is 2. So altogether, Jamie is spending £28. But that's not the answer to this question. It then says, how much change does he get from £40? One way of doing it would be to count up from 28 until you get to 40. Well, 28 plus, plus 2 would be 30. And 30 plus... An extra 10 would be 40. So our £2 plus our £10 to get us from 28 to 40 would be £12. Therefore, the answer is £12 change. The other way of doing it is to start with the £40, which is paying. And to see how much change we're getting, subtract off how much he's actually spent. So he spent £28. And see what's left. Zero take away eight we can't do, so we borrow one. Ten take away eight is two, and three take away two is one. So you can see it's the same answer again. So how much change does he get for forty pounds? The answer is twelve pounds.